Hey guys, Predator here, welcome back to Fishing Barrow Sea. We are to continue on with our trawling tutorial. So, part number two when you travel far enough to the northwest, an icon will appear in the left with the main HUD in third person view, which you can click to continue the traveling to the open water. Press V to switch to third person mode, click go to open water button on the right. Boom, there we go. Alright, so now that you're in open water, you can start trawling. Set speed to 4 knots, which is optimal trawl speed for trawling. Open crew management interface below. And then set our trawl. So let's slow ourselves down. We're not even. I don't know what speed 4 knots is. Let's go. Options, game, nautical. There we go, that'll help. That didn't work. Why did that not work? Aha, that's distance. Knots, there we go, knots. Right, let's get ourselves at four knots. Work out what our best speed is going to be. Let's get these guys ready to set the trawl. Okay, first person only. Slow ourselves. Right down, we only want to be four knots. I think that's going to be alright. Maybe a little bit more. Alright, so we're here. So now change. Sit at the control deck. That's what we did. Set to set troll interact with the set troll button on your left. So down here. Uh, where is it? There we go, set trawl net. Congratulations, you're now trawling. You can interact with two levers to your left and right in order to control the length of the warp wires. This determines the depth and lateral position of the trawl doors and the trawl net. Look at the forward sonar in the right corner of the screen. In front of you, here you will see your pot and starboard trawl door. Circles the schools of fish in the closest circle marked with the distance from your ship. Release the wires until trawl doors at 50 metres for more of for, for more for optimal catch, but we're meant to be bottom trawling I think. Um, set both leaders in idle position to lock the trawl doors at current depth. Closer schools of fish are being marked. Catch the sender, sensor indicates how much of a trawl bag. Um, adjust the warp wire length and levers until the trawl doors are at the same depth as the schools of fish then lock the doors at depth. To aim at schools of fish to the passes by between your trawl doors. Now trawl for 10,000 kilos of fish. Alright, so we need to Um, look at our screen, I guess. Um, so catch. So what is that? I can't remember what some of these things are. DP, what's DP number three? Which is that one, I think, isn't it? No, that's the hawk. Alright, so to go go back. So I wanna go oops, depth of the doors, depth of the head rope. So that might be the depth of the head rope. Okay, um depth of the ship. Is that depth underneath the ship, I think? Right, let's get rid of the navigation side of things. So depth of the head rope. So that's the top, and that's a depth to the bottom. So let's go depth of the ship. So they're both, you know, depths of the doors. Um, depth of the head rope. Depth of the sh depth of to the bottom, I guess. Is that to the bottom? I don't know, depth number four ship. So it's still getting further and further. Uh, distance to the doors. Get rid of that. We want to get the the hock so it shows us the opening the height, the opening, and I can't remember what that means now. I 
not exactly sure. Spider, what's a spider ship? Ah, oh, yep, okay, cool. So you want to make sure you've sort of got everything running right. Um, Alright, let's get back out of there. Guess we can set our guys back to resting. There's not much they can do while the trawl's set. Um, we pretty much just need to watch the school of fish, but obviously our doors are too far down, I think. Awesome! Successfully caught 10,000 kilos of fish. You may continue trawling if you want. The trawl net on Lunar Bow can up to 500 tons. Otherwise, when you're ready to continue, you can prepare to haul the trawl in the trawl net. Alright, so let's get back out of here. Let's go pause both of these nets because that didn't really work. Let's reel them back in a little bit, I guess. Actually, we're going to need to go navigation. So we're only doing 2.3 knots. Need to bump the speed up a little bit. And keep an eye on. Let's let our doors down again. I'm pretty sure if we go into here, um, not into logbook, into here, fishing tools, pelagic trawling. Okay, so these guys aren't the bottom trawlers, these guys are. Okay, cool. So just make sure I've got the right thing sort of selected. Right, so the depth is 70, let's stop that. Right, so we need to swap these over. So depth 2, let's add this one, depth number 1. There we go, so I can sort of work out and have our doors at the same sort of depth. There we go, both at 68 metres, so now we need to go let them both down, because you can see there's a school of fish here, and we need to get it down, down to where it is. So let's bump up our speed again, because we're only doing three knots. So the more stuff we have in the net, the more it's going to slow us down, I think. So you pretty much just trawl. You know, you, if you want to, you can just, you know, set the net and just walk away and come back 10 minutes later and see if you caught anything. Or you can actually sit down and, you know, watch and try and catch certain things. But, you know, for me, I guess I've never never really been able to work out how to do it properly so wait till we get our our fish completely full so the opening we're getting a little bit of fish not a great deal I'm holding the S key now to try and move the doors down Oop, I just lost the fish again so I don't know how we can get fish and then we stop getting fish. That's one thing that's always sort of, you know, bugged me a little bit. Alright, so from what I understand, from there to there should be the top part of the net. And then the opening should be down here. So I guess that's one thing that, you know, as I said, I've never actually been able to sort of work out. Um, uh, yep, doesn't really say much in there. Alright, let's lock these guys. I don't know why our nets so all over the place. Right, let's lock you two and see how they even out. Now it's just changed completely where we are. So let's let's reel it back in again. So it says about 50 meters. So I think if we try and 
try and keep our net, you know, I think we're certainly too low here, we're nearly at the bottom of the ocean, so clearance to the bottom is one. Alright, looks like we're getting some fish at the moment. Getting plenty of fish. Um, okay, why are we going? Ah, uh, we're going backwards. Why the hell are we going backwards? That's me using the WISD key, not the the arrows. So we're s <laughs> technically we probably should have lost all the fish we had in the nets then. All right, let's slow ourselves down a little bit more. About 4.3 knots. Go back forward again. Let's. So we're reeling in, reeling in again. We did get a little bit of fish, we're probably at 40% full, so hopefully we can start to get a little bit more. I want to reel these guys in. I'm pretty sure it must be the arrow keys that we use. If we go uh, keys, trawl doors, up, down, left, right, yeah, okay. Don't use the WASD key because that really doesn't help. That just makes you go backwards really fast. So there's a couple of whales over there off to our left. Or our, was it port side? Right, it's always port, stop, it's left, I think. I don't know, don't quote me on it. See, the problem now is I can't see the doors on here and clearance to the bottom so I don't understand what that is is that the depth from the bottom of the boat to here I'm assuming that's what that means we're starting to get the net off the bottom though so that's good so I'm gonna try and Right, there's our net, our net there. So I think let's stop you. See what you settle at. We'll let this other side reel back in again. Try and get about the same. Try and get some of this fish here if possible. Alright, that's it. Stop. Oop, wrong button. I don't know if we're actually going to get it or not though. So we should have our net sort of here. If that's how it works. The opening is 126 meters, so... I think Why are we still... It's like we're still reeling the net in. Uh, let's go... Distance between the doors. I've got a length. Don't really know what that means. Um, length. So the depth of the door, length of the door, let's get rid of that one. Okay, so they're the depths and they're the lengths, of course. Alright, so I was obviously looking at the wrong thing. Uh, let's reel you both out a little bit more. So that's 210. The other side down to 210. And we'll leave it and we'll just sort of see what happens, I guess, see if we can catch anything else. Alright, 210 to 11, that's close enough. So we've still got the fish to the left of us. If I use the left arrow, I can try and move the. Try 
try and move the doors or we can try and turn left here and see if that's going to help us sort of pick it up a little bit. Alright, don't want to go too quick. 4.5 knots, we're still going a little bit too quick. Sort of go in the middle there. I don't know if that's going to help us at all to get this fish here or not. Just one of those things, I think. Um, you know, it is it is hard to to sort of get your head around how it works. Certainly for me. Um, I know previously I've had a lot of people comment and say that I'm doing things wrong and all that sort of stuff, but um, there is a trawling basics guide as well, which does help. Um, I don't know. Probably read through that and it'll help you out a fair bit, but. Um, yeah, there's heaps of stuff in here to read through. And a few videos as well. So if you guys have got Fishing Baron C, have a look at um, the guides and stuff through Steam and it should help you, hopefully. But at this point in time, we don't really have much going on. So let's, um, let's reel, reel it all in. We'll just take the catch we've got. And um, yeah, see how much fish we actually got. So I think if we're forty percent full, maybe we should have about what they say five hundred thousand. So maybe one hundred fifty, two hundred thousand uh, kilos of fish. So that'll be pretty good. But I don't know what our hold sort of is. Um, so one full net, we'll be able to fill our boat, but. I don't think we're going to get that at this point in time, so we'll just reel, reel the net in. If we're lucky, we might even be able to get some fish while we're reeling the net in, but I don't think it's going to happen. Um, is the arrow keys... Right, now things all over the place, it's just me hitting buttons, it's like it's stuck. That's weird, <laughs> it really is weird. Alright, troll nets, we can manage our crew, speed which we can't really do anything with. We should be able to press these buttons, but I don't think we can at the moment. So it looks like we should be in, from this, if it goes completely red like this, then you should be in a decent school of fish, but we're not really getting anything at the moment. When it goes completely red and this is level 9, that's perfect. That's exactly what we want. So if we had left our doors down, we might have been able to get this little little patch here, but... Oh well, doesn't matter. Let's manage our crew, so bring these guys down and back in to haul the trawl. Um, Alright, so interact with the two levers to your left and right until they're both angled towards you. Haul in the trawl door so 25, 25 minutes from the ship and interact with your haul trawl button over here to lift your trawl bag on board. So our crew are on the front of the boat here getting ready to go so they'll grab the bag, lift it up and I think they'll I think one of these, that's a crane, one of them is a pump, I think. So they'll pump um, the fish out of the net. I think, where is this? I don't, that's not the pump there, I don't think. One of these is the pump here anyway, I think. We'll have a look, once it's getting ready to get, get done. See, this area here looks looks awesome but just not getting anything from what it's telling me here but that looks like it's if we had had our nets back down again that would have been perfect all right crawl 
crew will automatically haul it on board. So let's do the haul. Haul the troll. I uh, don't know what's going on here. Uh, I have no idea what's going on at the moment. Let me pause the video and I'll get back to you. Righto guys are back. So I think the game crashed on me. Um, could have been because I had the HUD turned off. Not exactly sure. So let's, um, before we go too much further, get another screenshot. I don't know if I did get one before or not. Get one again just in case. Um, leave the hut up the whole time. Got our workers out on deck ready to go. Just waiting for this net to be within 25. There we go. Haul it in. So I had to start all over again back from back from Hammerfest all the way back out again and you know do all this stuff again so unfortunately it's just the way we had to do it. So the rear crane lifts the bag up which gets all the fish to go down into the water and then this um, pump or sucker I guess you call it sucks it all up and into the hold. See so how much fish we got. 42,722 kilos of mackerel, so nowhere near full, but you know, still pretty good nonetheless. Alright, I think we did just do that, did we not? Alright, can we go options? Don't know if we can get rid of this tutorial now because it's quickly go save career because I've had issues before don't know what's going on there but wants us to do it again so might need to just set the trawl out again and then keep going and do that sort of stuff but what I'm going to do guys I'm going to end the episode here anyway um, might put the nets back out um, let them let them go and just see what happens I guess try and um, fill our boat fill our boat and um, head back to, to Hammerfest next episode and see how much money we make so thank you guys for watching if you enjoyed it as always smash that like button leave a comment let me know what you think of this series so far and if you want to see it continue if you guys are new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet guys please do so it's been Bredo thanks for watching see you again soon